notice most of the videos we are shooting is uh, less than five minutes that is how i want the video to flow uh, for this year uh, right now if you have registered your school the next thing for you to do is to set the the uh, academic session remember the academic session is very important because if you register your candidate on a different academic session you will not be able to upload them so for 2025 the year one the year the student start ss1 is 2022 not 2023 2023 is for 2026 candidates so you click on the 2022 and that way you'll be able to uh register the candidate set academy session and then if we go over to student this is the procedure for registering a student you can see surname first name this is a standard form you just have to select a photo and remember that the photo have to be uh, size the way uh, we have told you to size why has their own way of sizing their photo inside the cast software so watch the video for uh, sizing your photos that way you'll be able to follow through with this uh, tutorial so i'll go head over to pictures i would select any of this you just enter in this whole name uh, John Doe. remember the year has to be more than 14. i think this one was born in 2010 and then phone number must be provided email must be provided then you must select nine subject remember to start with a third course uh, you must select so if you ask how i'm uh, going fast on entering the cs if you select uh, for art students you find the ca from number two so if you click two on your keyboard you find art courses if you click five you see science courses so this is how the flow goes and then other courses uh, computer science will be from six downward so this is how you feel this work form you have a maximum of 20 subjects and a minimum of eight so uh, make sure you are selecting the subjects remember that the subjects you are selecting must be subject that is supported by Y to be registered in that very school some subjects can be registered for the student but you will not find it when trying to do a uh, thumbprint for the candidate because the school has not registered that subject on the Y system so except this the subject is approved for the school you won't be able to register that uh, subject for that uh, student and for that school so select confirm and then submit this form if you submit this form you get something like this as uh, a response 